木壳。So bored with old number. Look, I don't want to buy any of your shit. I don't want any of the crap. Just leave me the fuck alone. And uh... oh, oh, <laughs> dude, I'm sorry. Let me put you on speaker, man. Put you on speaker. Gaffer, yeah, gaffer. Hello, hello, Ricky, gaffer. my man. How's it going? It's good. Long time I, no see. I say, gaffer, you're there. You're there, gaffer. Right, gaffer, yeah. gaffer. I, I got a mate, gaffer. Up at Newcastle, needs help, needs oh. help, big help. They're in trouble, Gaffer. <laughs> oh, Ricky, you joker, man. You joker. Who the hell would you know up there? Alan Shearer, Gaffer. You know Alan. Who? Alan, the sorcerer Shearer, you know, goals. Goals. How do you know? We used to go partying down the clubs in Newcastle, Gaffer, when I was there. You know, oh, okay. good boy and all that, you know. The desperate Gaffer, Rafa, he's, he's got himself... He's got himself in a right dicky state. He had some dodgy chicken or something. I don't know, yeah. but I reckon he's going to be out for the rest of the season. It must have been a big chicken, <laughs> Gaffer. <laughs> Is this a wind up? No, Gaffer, very serious Gaffer. It's a wind up, isn't it? No, it we is told Ricky, him. I said, I know this Gaffer, we had him down at an eating a Bolton and he was the bestest Gaffer in the world and he could come in here no, and no, he could no, sort all right. that yeah, and he okay, save you okay, from the yeah, All right, I'll tell you what, you tell him, you tell him, you say, FM, he's on the way. He's on, he's on the bus, I'm going to get the bus now. Right? Yeah? Cool. R R R Ricky, Ricky, um, I don't suppose you can lend us a fiver, could what? you? Get the bus, oh, I'm not sure. Oh, fucking no, nothing. Ricky? Rick? Ricky, what is going on guys, FMU here. That is correct. We're going to be going forwards and we're going to be doing a The Saviour Cometh FM16 Challenge. So, um, yeah, feel free to hit the like button down below in preparation for what is going to be a wonderful journey. I uh, would really appreciate that. And if you haven't subscribed, do it now. Do it now. Follow me on Twitter as well while you're down there. It's in that general direction. The links are all down below because I'm very organised. Um, so we're going to go into this with Newcastle United and uh, we're going to try to save them from the brinks of destruction. Let's have a little look, shall we, and see what we've got in store for us in this little mini series. All right, so like I say, we're going to be doing the Saviour Cometh Challenge and uh, Newcastle United are going to be, he's going to be our home. Ricky Fish, he's been here. He knows Alan Shearer, apparently, or suddenly, randomly, as I say, who becomes the Newcastle manager. Uh, so we're going to come and take over. Poor old Rafa's had a bit of a nasty bit of chicken and we're going to take over till the end of the season, see if we can't guide him to safety, all right? Right, I've gone for, I've done all the gubbins with the, uh, you know, the the player profiles to, ooh, Newcastle, I see this is what I like about these things. It's got all the different sort of stuff in it. Newcastle appoint half as manager. Campbell half lead Newcastle United to Premier Division survival. We're in a perilous position at this stage of the season. Half has been tasked with keeping them up. Ricky sent me here to, st to stave off relegation. Can we do it? I suppose we'll just have to wait and see, won't we? Good Lord, this bloody headline's clinging on for dear life. Jesus. So the saviour cometh. Chairman Mike Ashley. Boo. Has uh, blah, 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 whatever. I don't give a shit what he says. I'm not going to look at Lee Table just yet. Newcastle of How Howard Hyeth as manager. Very good. We've we started with me to go on. Uh, transfer update. All of those. Wow. That's a lot of loaned out players. See, I quite like Re Remy Cavalla. I know a lot of people don't, I do. And Forvin, I think he, I don't understand why he's not getting much of a chance at Newcastle. But then again, I don't watch the week in, week out, so I don't really know. It's not somewhere where I can, you know, discuss. It's none of my business. What's this? Many people think that Newcastle's wage budget is simply too small for you to bring in a high-quality player. Uh, the budget is business set. 
yeah, we don't want to piss Ashley off straight away, do we? Uh, yeah, all right, all right, come on. Right, so the Premier Division is looking like that. Oh, we're not in exactly the worst position in the world, are we? Whoa, we are 11 points behind Watford. That's painful. But uh, Sunderland down there and Aston Villa are down there. A bit harsh on Sunderland and Villa, but I suppose Villa, not quite so much. But Sunderland, they did stay up, you know. Bournemouth! Look at Bournemouth and West Brom. My life! The best in the world. Clear, well, not quite. Man City are a lot higher than them. But Bournemouth and West Brom kicking some, uh, kicking some plants over, aren't they? Jesus. So let's have a look at the schedule thus far. Oh, my God. We won the first three games. Drew against Villa. Got beat by Burton. No disrespect to Burton, but you'd think Newcastle would be beating teams such as Burton in the Capital One Cup and haven't won a game since. We've lost every single game. And we start with Manchester City. Huzzah! We've got we've got knocked out of the FA Cup by it, which that's fine, that's okay, we can cope with that. Oh my jeez! We've got Manchester City, then Liverpool, two easy games. Then Villa, which is a big game. West West Ham, Tottenham, Chelsea, Leicester. Do we, we play Sunderland towards the end? Do we play Watford, a team that we're trying to catch up? So it's not the easiest to run ins, is it? Let's be honest. Um, I, I want to run away, but hey, these things happen. We're on the 16th of January. We've got an overall budget of 7 million. Are you taking the piss? A transfer budget of 380,000. Mike Ashley, you are, a, you are a gentleman indeed. You are a gentleman indeed. You won't be able to find pants big enough to fit your ass for 380,000 pounds. Not where you shop, I bet, my friend. Um, but yeah, so we're in the shit and uh, we... we <laughs> So, that's it. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Um, yeah, so, guys, we're going to go... The next episode is going to be the first uh, the first game. This was just an introduction with a bit of fun at the beginning. I don't know if you noticed I was trying to be funny. I don't, don't think it works. But um, we're going to come in and do the first game, the Manchester game. Might do two games. Might just come straight in at a game, considering we're going to be going in. So what I want you to do down below in the comments is, do I try my usual philosophy tactic that I use? Or do, can you guys recommend a tactic that you think will help me get Newcastle out of this? Let me know in the comments down below. Remember, on your way down to comment, hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, and follow me on Twitter. And I stream, when I stream, I don't stream a lot, but I stream on YouTube gaming because it's easy for me. So, uh, yeah, if you follow me on, if you sub to me on YouTube, then you'll find me on there when I, when I do live streaming, which is very rare, but it's always a sexy time when I do it. Guys, girls, uh, out of time for now, but remember, hit me in the comments down below. Not literally, it'd hurt, but, uh, and you break your screen. And then it would be the idiot. So, uh, yeah, I'm out of time. As always, guys, it's been an absolute pleasure being in your face. Bye-bye. What have we done? We're going to get out of this? For fuck's sake.